An Indian man was declared dead after a road accident and put in a morgue freezer. Oops. The next day, the family found him alive. Forty five years old. He was oh in a motorcycle God. accident, declared dead on arrival by a private clinic before being taken to the government hospital. He was Keith put in the freezer these. there. I don't love these, although love them. I did pay three dollars for the newspaper. Nothing was in it for me except this article. And I'm like, <laughs> worth it. So maybe you're right. OK, I talked it out. This so, it, it's Keith, just you a, just prayed on it. You didn't even realize it's just yeah. one more fact that tells you my idea is brilliant, that when you die, they throw you in the room with other dead bodies, leave you there for three days. There's a buzzer on the inside to get out. Why not? Too I many think, people are being put away, not dead. And it's shocking and it's happening all over the world. I say this every time you say that they yeah. used to do that. I believe that's why it's called a dead ringer. But um, mm -hmm. they used to put a bell or a, a, a thing to pull. So if they buried you by accident because you drank so much or whatever, put you in like this weird coma. When you woke up three days later, you'd pull on the thing. People would uh, unbury you. Do it again. Yeah. Now, I know they're going to have to start putting weird signs on the inside, like, uh, you know, don't fuck the bodies, just push the button because, you know, people are weird. But I, I think you'd save some lives for sure. Sounds like it. Sorry, right? Keith. Nobody cares. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, nobody cares about these bodies. They like to say I don't want to give you too much good stuff too fast. I understand that. Well, I just, you know, I just I'm not trying to make you feel better. You know, you can keep crying about that one. That one's hard. That, that is hard. Yeah, that one's eh, hard. seems pretty dead, right? Bob, pretty dead. Then the family comes in. The woman said, here's a quote. He's not at all dead. How did this happen? Look, he wants to say something. He's breathing. Then hospitals got act like it's a miracle. Number mm. of miracles today on the board. It's like 72 this year. Mm, just like how many virgins weird. It's too much. That 72 <laughs> number. It's very strange. Look. And it adds up to nine, which is a magic number. Oh, I love that you think that way. You ever look at an address and you're like, that's a good address because if you add oh. this and you add that. Oh, license plates, too. Mm, you see how Hannah and I just become official friends. Thank you, everybody. You were here. Mm -hmm. Where numbers ever happen. These are the geniuses that understand mother. <laughs> <laughs>